returned together <laughs> to the International Criminal Court, which admitted the Waki report. Um, on the other hand, throughout the KNCHR uh, report and others as well, um, Jubilee now saying that they will be meeting to deliberate on whether they need to form a committee that will um, perhaps seek to investigate the Waki reports, largely the content remaining mysterious. What do you make of this development? You see, human rights investigations are not criminal investigations. Human rights investigations are documentation of certain instances of possible violations of rights. If you look at any human rights investigation, it just simply tries to build a potential scenario of how those violations might have occurred. What happens then? You now submit these reports to other agencies that have greater legal or constitutional mandate to facilitate an investigation or which can discharge criminal responsibility. So what we did is to present the KCHR report to the Waki Commission. So admitting the Waki report by, by implication means it admitted part of the information that the Waki report was able to document. But isn't it just, just a minute. Mm -hmm. and, being, and then using their own capacity to verify that information. Because Waki had investigation reports from the CID, they were able to interview people that we were not able to interview. They were able to be given reports from the then NSIS, which is now the NIS. So they had a, a, a threshold of information that we did not have. Okay, on the other hand, the accusation and allegation against KNCHR was that the report was then cooked to protect, on one hand, some individuals and fix individuals on the other. So then, they, then maybe now they, 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 that, that, that is not at play anymore, the fact that the, the, the KNCHR report just on, yeah, a, on, a, on a technical argument, on a technical argument. The fact that that's the reason why it was then rejected. It is, uh, Sophia, they were, there was, you saw the ratio as it and I for, for the judges, there was no such, such issue. What happens is the, the Waki report was a core base of evidence and the Waki had the capacity to be able to, to, to sift through the evidence that was provided to them. And whatever they found as trash, if, if, we, if we, we had, if these allegations were to hold, if we had decided to to, 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 to protect anybody, then the Waki report and every other, the other investigations that took place had the capacity to bring these people back on board. Because right. the threshold of evidence and, and, and the, the documentation is still there for anybody to, to assess. There is a, that whole, you know, we, we created a software in the KCHR at that time, uh, which is backed up even in several remote locations. Okay. Whatever evidence you put in it, you cannot, you, cannot, you cannot remove it. So even if today the local machinery here wants to, con to conduct an investigation, that information is there. It's still there. Uh, Bona Chairman, do you see this, uh, the recalling of the Waki report as something that is progressive? Well, to the extent <laughs> that it is offering some uh, uh, sort of evidence, I think, I think the, the whole point about uh, uh, um, uh, any, any, any judicial proceedings at any level is to get the best evidence uh, uh, that is available in order to assist the court to arrive at, at the closest that they can to uh, um, uh, the truth. Uh, uh, although, although it is said that uh, uh, judicial proceedings are not about truth, they are about uh, 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 evidence. So to the extent that uh, the uh, uh, Waki uh, uh, report um, uh, um, offers uh, uh, evidence that touch on the matters in question before the court, um, yes, I, th I, th I think it's, it's, it's um, I see nothing wrong with that. Because you see, remember that that report itself will be subjected to, to the normal uh, evidential uh, uh, determination of the veracity of the report and, and, then, and then weigh the value of the evidence uh, insofar as the matters in question uh, are concerned. So for me, um, I, I see nothing wrong with the uh, yes. Since the report is already there, I see nothing wrong with it. Well, uh, as you yeah. comment on the same, do you support these calls by the Jubilee members to look at the report, yeah. the contents yeah. of yeah. it? Yeah. What yeah. concerns uh, yeah. do they have yeah. about yeah. it? They say largely a lot of it has oh. remained mysterious, even in terms of that envelope and the people it? who are implicated. Uh, yes, I think, uh, first of all, let me say that uh, my uh, friend, my younger brother, the senator, and his KNHCR, will go into the history of this country that at the time when the country needed the most they gathered rumors which <laughs> they never bothered even to question the people implicated, the implicated people, even at an international level at the ICC where they accept even opinions, they looked at what they did and said, useless that is history you have left as a legacy that you have left and it's a sad one 
the work report had a lot of mystery around it. The envelope, there were rumors it had 20 people, it had 30 people, it had so and so. And uh, you know, I keep on saying that the ICC, it is easier to put a case in ICC than in Kibera. Because Kibera, you can't go with a winjo in Kibera. A winjo is what I've had. In ICC, you can go with it. I had so and so was planning this. So it, there would be need for Kenyans to know what was in this report, what was looked at, who are in it, who are the 20 people in the envelope. But let Kenyans know so that speculation is, is reduced tremendously. So I think those calls have uh, some basis, especially if uh, part of the, the, the things that um, work relied on are rumors that were gathered by KNSCR, which the, 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 the ICC says are basic rumors. Well, let me tell so you, the, the one thing, let me just uh, teach this, uh, no, look at it. let me <laughs> teach him a bit of, uh, a yes, bit of work. Uh, when, you, when, you, when, you, when you're doing an investigation, as I said, a human rights investigation is called a documentation. It is not called an investigation. That's why you say, uh, you know, an yes. a documentation <laughs> process. And when you document, you even document rumors. When you come to me and say, I heard there were people there. So what you do, you document that rumor. As a rumor. As a rumor. Yeah. And then tell, ask the, the now investigative authority. Right, right now there are rumors around who might have killed Mushai. You see? So you document those rumors. And the police then, with those investigative capacities, have the capacity to verify rumors. So, so they yours were rumors, you agree? They, they, some of them were rumors, some of them were factual, some of them were witness reports. So we, we, you see, if you came to us and said you are a witness, you had information to tell us, we will document it, tabulate it, uh, you know, uh, give it a, pin, uh, uh, what is, uh, 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 a reference number. We will call it, say, uh, you know, whatever that time can say, PIV -P 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 investigation. And then, you know, if you go to statement 0012, you will say that it is Michael Gitonga's statement. So then you go back to Michael and say, where did you get this information from? And therefore, then you start to to follow the leads so you document and anything and everything that's why you go there and ask anybody around there what did you see around this matter some will say i saw this person well, the first you know the first rumor that came out about the matter of mushai was that a car came and hit mushai from the back and mushai stopped and i remember we were saying even with some friends you never stop when somebody hits you at night you just continue driving and a lot of people have been mugged for that then it has evolved now that it wasn't necessarily uh, 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 hit, but he, he stopped to buy papers. Mm -hmm. So you document anything and everything. Then you subject it now to the scrutiny of agencies like the CID, the NIS, okay. the, the Waki Commission and others. You have to understand these processes rather than become, politi become a politician of, of the right, Jubilee. Let's, let's 